Hi everyone, today I'm going to be making a mixed beetroot slaw salad. Let's go on to that. Firstly, with my two ready washed and peeled beets, I'm going to grate them into this bowl. As you can see, this is a lot of hard work and you have to put a lot of muscle into it. So I'm going to ask my dad to help me finish this off and see after it's done. Now my beets have finished being grated, I'm going to add four stalks of thinly sliced celery. Now I'm going to add one whole English cucumber that has been washed and thinly sliced. Now my cucumber has been added, I'm going to mix it all up. Now I'm going to add my three thinly sliced scallions, also known as spring onions. This slaw mixture can be stored in the fridge for up to three days. And you could take portions at will and you could eat it as a side dish, but we're going to carry on making our salad. Now I'm going to take two scoops of this slaw and put it into this bowl. Now that's done, I'm going to add two whole lemons that I've already squeezed into a bowl. I'm going to add two tablespoons of olive oil. Now I'm going to add a sprinkle of black pepper. And some salt. Now that's done, I'm going to give it a little mix. Now that's mixed, I'm going to leave it to one side and prepare my avocado. I'm only going to be using half of this avocado. Now I'm going to add a little bit of lemon onto this so it doesn't discolour. to chop the avocado into cubes. I'm going to leave that to one side and that will be ready for the topping. I'm going to serve my slaw on a handful of basil as I like the strong earthy taste. You can use cow or spinach, whatever you prefer. Now I'm going to add my nice beetroot slaw on top. You can see how juicy it is. It's going to add a nice sweet tangy flavour to my basil. Now you add all the juices. And for the finishing touch, I add my avocado. Now that's done, I'm going to add a little bit more black pepper and salt for a little bit more flavour. And this is what it should look like once it's done. Now it's time to tuck in. Mm. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed and see you next time.